Hello everyone, I'd like to share with you a few trades posted on Friday, November 4th and this one was shared by MG who's trading Nasdaq CFD and as you see there was a breakout and is retesting the previous uh, support area and now you can see that better in the 5 minute charts and with 1 minute chart there is a trading channel that is very clear he enters here at this point and using exit strategy number one he set the targets and a stop loss and managed the trades uh, let's see his live video and as you see here he reached the target at this point and close it with profit so thank you mg for sharing your trades with us the next trades were shared by mh who's trading dax in form of cft using forex broker you see the one minute structural chart showing that the buyers are back and is retesting the previous resistance level and in this area that he was going up to retest that area he see it with the tick chart a channel and enters with algo one to five here and exit here based on exit strategy number one and again the DAX shows another also uptrend uh, in the channel you see the structural here and with the trading chart here he takes a pullback uh, of this channel in this area based on algo one to five and exit properly in the middle part of channel with exit strategy number one so thank you mh for sharing your trades with us uh, the next trade was shared by Yasin, who's trading S&P 500 in mini futures and you see the macro is in kind of uptrend but it's showing pullback toward retesting the dynamic support area so you can see it in this five minute chart as this channel that is going down and with the one minute structural chart you see a downtrend clearly so using a trading chart which is a tick chart he finds entry based on this channel and enters here properly by following algorithm one to five when the pullback completes and exit the stage number one and he closes it with profit as you see so thank you Yasin for sharing your trades with us so these are some of my trades I missed the beginning of New York market session I'm trading S&P 500 futures as you see the macro of five minute and the structural one minute all are in uptrend so I'm taking pullbacks using the 10 second charts repeatedly and ATM of the Ninja Trader manage that and I also exit manually whenever I see pullback and I see the buyers are back I add to the long positions like this and wait for the Ninja to work or I close it manually I adjust the target if I see the buyers are not strong and close it sooner if I see deep pullback like this I add only one position and set other positions and adjust the stop and I may add to the position if I see uh, less risk or reduce the position if I see risk of reversal so we're just waiting for the buyers are coming back and I may close one position quickly as you see here because the buyers were not so strong and the pullback was very deep and it's kind of sideways now again if I see buyers are strongly coming back and trade is continuing in this case I just add one or two position and watch it closely and you see one position close with profit another with break even so these are the list of trades i finished today and as you see i reached profit factor of 2.8 and i had about 76 percent win rate with average win to loss ratio of 0 0.85 so thank you for your attention and hope these trades are useful for you and let us know if you have any questions. Have a wonderful day and weekend.